It's been more than six weeks since Siemens apprentice Ryan Sawyer Mays was in military court. He faces charges related to arson in the July 2020 fire that destroyed the USS Bonham Richard. The head of the Third Fleet, Vice Admiral Stephen Kohler, has decided not to reveal the hearing officer's decision until he decides whether to accept her recommendation. Robert Muth is with the Veterans Legal Clinic. He says it's something peculiar to military justice. If you can imagine an environment where they are deployed or underway, a commander would want to be able to have the power to ensure that his his troops are behaving in the his or her um, intended fashion. However, of course, the, the cons to that is you have someone who is not legally trained, who is making a very sometimes complicated decision, particularly in the case of like an arson case. The admiral can also throw out decisions even after a conviction. Congress has looked at limiting the role of commanders in military justice. The law recently changed to remove them entirely in cases of sexual assault. So you've seen cases where commanders have said, I know this individual, I think they're a good person, I don't think it would be something that they would do. Whereas a prosecutor um, who happened to know the individual involved would never be involved in that case in the first place. It has already been a long haul to bring the Bonhomme Richard case to a court martial. The fire happened 18 months ago. Still, the legal standard for bringing a case to trial is whether it's more likely than not that Mays committed the crime. Steve Walsh, KPBS News.